just curious, uh, when you kind of figured out that uh, that being a special teams gunner was was uh, something that you were good at, um, and, and like how, how long did it take you to kind of figure that out? Uh, I played it a little bit in college. I know I'm fast, and I know I can make tackles. And they told me this year that I was going to play. So I guess it just kind of came natural to me. I guess. One of the things that uh, one of the things that that Sean Payton was saying is the the difficulty in that position is is uh, beating double teams. Um, so how do you kind of view that? Like like when you, when you're facing something like that, how how do you uh, how do you kind of approach it? Uh, I just play to my strengths. Um, knowing I'm fast, uh, knowing that I you know for the most part I think I'm a strong guy. So. I just try to dictate where I'm going to go and don't let them tell me where to go. Shazer? I, um, I think you said in, in training camp you like playing special teams. What about special teams do you like? And secondly, on the two plays you made, um, the, the, the when you started the punt and also when you made the tackle, what, what did you specifically see on those two plays? Um, I like special teams because just play fast. Um, it's really just a lot of times effort plays. There's some technique involved um, for sure, but special teams is just anybody's play to make. And uh, those two plays um, against Green Bay, is, I'm guessing that's the one you're referring to. Um, I just, I was able to peek the ball and I saw that he wasn't going to catch it and I just went to go field it rather than letting it hit and it potentially bounce into the end zone. And then uh, the tackle that I made in the game um, it was a bang-bang play and something we talked about. Um, so, I don't know, just ran fast and beat my guy to the ball and took my shot. Hey, Gus. Hey, Ty. Um, what was last week and then the start of this week like with a bunch of the offensive coaches out and uh, Coach Galliano out as well. Like, what was it like preparing for that game, and then you know continuing to prepare this week without them? Um, the voices and the faces were definitely missed. Um, it was weird not seeing a lot of the coaches there, but ultimately, you know, we got a job to do. And no matter who installs it and how it gets installed, um, I mean, it matters how it gets installed. But no matter who's doing it, uh, we know what to do, and we just got to go out there and execute. Luke Johnson. Hey, Ty, this morning, uh, Sean Payton referenced um, it, uh, New England forces a ton of turnovers at home, and usually when they do that, they, they win ball games up there. Um, I, I know you guys just week in, week out, place a lot of emphasis on taking care of the ball. I, I was just wondering if this was kind of different than in other places you've been, other stops you've had, as far as just the emphasis placed here on ball security. I mean, in terms of playing against New England? Well, just in generally speaking about just taking care of the football here, you know, Sean, Sean was just making a point by saying they force a lot of turnovers, and usually when they do that, they win games. Um, so it seems like that's probably going to be a point of emphasis for you guys this week, but it, it always is, it feels like, here as well. Um, yeah, I think um, turnover differential is important no matter who you play. Um, but we have a lot of numbers people, and their job is to look at numbers, and the numbers show that New England – um, wins a lot of games when they win the turnover differential then it definitely becomes a point of emphasis um, but taking care of the ball is something that um, we, sh we should focus on week in and week out anyways.